Hi, this is Galit Gofrob and welcome to my Gorilla Life Coaching videos. Five times a week I talk about a quote that can help you move your life to a better, healthier and happier place for you and I hope you gain a lot of value from these videos. So how are you doing today? I hope you're feeling in a giving mood because today our quote of the day is, to do more for the world than the world does for you, that is success by Henry Ford. Giving is the key to your success. What you give, you will get back. And in this video, I will talk about why this is so. We are always in the process of giving something. If you give intentionally with the mindset of spreading love, abundance, and happiness, then this is what you will get back a tenfold. Basically, everything that you will give out will come back to you. As Newton stated in his third law of motion, when two objects interact, they apply forces to each other of equal magnitude and opposite direction. When you are giving out energy or anything basically that you're giving out, you will get it back in equal magnitude. So the energy you feel when you give anything to anyone, the intention that you hold when you take any action will come back to you. If you are doing things from love and care and kindness to other people, the energy that you give out will return to you in some form. It doesn't matter how much or how little you give. It is the energy of giving that you have aroused within you and within the recipient that will come back to you. This is why they say that whatever you give, you get back in multitude. Because what you give to another not only holds the energy of you, the giver, but also the energy of the person who received from you and all of the people it affected and, benefit, and benefited as a result on the other person's side as well. For example, if you help a person heal, you will feel good that you have helped them. And since you did it from a place of love and care, then these emotions have an energy and this energy will come back to you. But also, the receiver's feelings of happiness and gratitude will come back to you. And if they had a spouse or children whom are also grateful, then their feelings of love and gratitude will also come back to you. Now you can see how whatever you give comes back in multitude. If you do every action from a place of giving love and kindness and abundance, you will always know only prosperity, love, and happiness in your life from this moment on. Give without expectation from the other person. There is nothing that you send out that will not come back to you. This is the law of attraction. Fuse with beneficial emotions any of your actions and during the giving process and you will receive the things that produce those emotions back to you. Give out love and care and this is what will come back to you tenfold different ways, in tenfold different ways, like in the form of money, in the form of patience, help, support, health, success, a great relationship, and so on. It is all about the mindset in which you are living your life. If you are in the mindset that you are giving from love and care and kindness, everything you do will propel more of these into your life. A few days ago, I spoke about the hero's journey in one of these videos. The hero's journey is only fulfilled and the person will only become a real hero when they give back to society from what they learned or gained during their journey. This act of giving from a place of sharing, from a place of love, is what makes them a real hero. All of the difficulties the person goes through on their hero's journey, it is only to bring them to a place of understanding that what makes them the happiest and most fulfilled and what will help all of the other people is giving from love and care. So do unto others what makes you feel good, what generates good vibes within you, and what generates love within you. When you do this during the help or service of other, of other people, then these are the feelings that will return to you tenfold. Feel these positive emotions when you are in the act of giving to another person. I also recommend giving more than is expected, and you will get much more than you ever expect back. Nothing can make your life richer than the act of giving. Anything you do in life that you do not only for yourself is an act of giving. And if you focus your days on doing for others from care and love, this will make you wake up in the morning feeling energized, happy, and fulfilled even before your day has begun. It will make you feel elated and generous. And then when you feel these feelings of elation, 
generosity, prosperity, what do you think will be given back to you? Exactly those things, those things that will bring those feelings to you. Whatever you give in terms of emotion, when you make the other people feel good or benefit in some way that they will appreciate now or in the future, then you will get the benefits that you reaped upon them tenfold. If you give from joy and happiness and rouse these feelings in another person when they receive from you, then nothing can really be better than this. Think of how much love and joy you are spreading in the world. This is love and joy that you give one person affects so many other people. And this is why you get back tenfold every time you give something out from a place of love or from any place really. The opposite is also true. When you give out negative vibes, you will get negativity 10 times back into your life. So choose each of your daily actions wisely. Take conscious action. Focus on giving and giving and giving, giving love, giving health, giving uh, goodness, giving uh, happiness, inspiration, motivation, education, money, and your time. These energies, when giving, will transform your life immediately to a much better place than where you are currently. With this change of mindset towards everything you do to make it an act of giving, you are planting positive seeds, positive energy, uh, positive energy of giving, and these will blossom into the grandest prosperity and fulfillment for you as well. Wow, what an opportunity it is to give. Giving with a positive emotion, intention, and positive state of mind is always more important than what you give. You remember this. How much joy can come from a simple act of giving to you, to the receiver, and to the world. You will even find that giving is actually addictive. This is known as helper's high. I'll explain. Uh, When you help other people, you not only benefit from what will come to you from the energy that you send out, but also you will get immediate um, reciprocation from the endorphins that will be released in your body, these feel-good chemicals that your body produces. These will immediately provide you with feelings of well-being. Yes, just like a runner's high, when endorphins are released during a run, endorphins are also released when you give, when giving. Apparently, we are built in such a clever way that when we are doing things that are good for us and good for other people, we actually feel great immediately through the release of endorphins. Uh, Touching other people and being touched, as I spoke about in the video on the massage therapy, as well as giving love and giving to others, and as well as eating healthy foods like fruits and nuts and seeds and doing exercise as well, all release endorphins. When we do the right things for us and for others, we are rewarded immediately. Isn't that such a clever thing to have? People become addicted to these feelings and search for them outside of their control to get these feelings back. If only they knew the power of giving to others releases the same chemicals in the body that cause feelings of well-being from uh, drugs, alcohol, and cigarettes in the beginning of the addiction. This is why so many people who have come out of rehab, any kind of rehab, choose to stay there and help others. They get the helper's high, which makes them feel just as good as the beginning when they were addicted to their addictive element. Check out my video on it, on overcoming addictions if you need. So you forget yourself in the sake for the sake of others when you give everything. Check out my video on overcoming addictions if you need. To forget oneself for the sake of others will actually give you everything you desire from life and much, much more. As Jim Rohn says, he who serves the most reaps the most. This is your key to success. Give the most with the energy of care, love, and compassion, and you will get fulfillment, joy, and abundance in every field of life in return. When you add value to other people's lives by being of service and living selflessly, then the good you spread will return to you as the same energy you put out into the world. Winston Churchill said, we make a living living by what we get, but we make a life by what we give. And Anne Frank said, no one has ever become poor by giving. 
you are always giving something anyway. So make sure it is something good. Make sure what you give out is really what you would like to get back. Even spending money is an act of giving. You are giving back to the person or business that has brought you value in some way. The movement of money between hands keeps this energy moving. And this is why I believe it is very important to have sufficient wealth. Even when you spend, you are giving. So when you spend with the energy of giving and loving, giving love and care and kindness, then when you spend your money, you will actually get more back. It is the mindset behind everything that you do that will make or break you. When you do everything as an act of giving, as an act of love, appreciation, and kindness, you will bring more of that energy into your life, and this will bring more love and kindness into the world overall. Give everything from a place of love, and love will fill your life so many more ways than you can ever imagine. So as I always do with these videos, I will provide you with a question or a few questions that will help move your life in a, to a, it's a better place for you. And the questions of the day are, in my day-to-day -day life, am I giving others what I would like to receive back? And would I really like to get what I am giving out? And how can I give more love? How can I give more to others? And when can I start to give from a place of love regularly? As usual, I recommend writing these questions in a notebook, especially prepared for these coaching sessions, so that you can look over them and make sure that you're moving your life to the best place for you. And the affirmation of the day is, I am in a constant state of giving from love, kindness, and compassion to everyone I meet. Wow, what an abundant life I lead. I am in a constant state of giving from love, kindness, and compassion to everyone I meet. Wow, what an abundant life I lead. Now tell this to yourself as many times as you remember to do so because an affirmation has the power to completely transform your life for the better with repetition. So I hope you liked this video. I hope you found it valuable. Uh, I hope you found it giving and I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you um, want, please subscribe to my channel and ring the notifications bell to get notified every time I upload a new video. And also please visit my website, thegorillediet.com to help you move your health and wellness to the best place for you. Thank you very much for joining.